Good morning, everybody. What's going on? Sports Gambling Daily. My name is Jared. That's Joe. Joe, let's jump right on into this matchup. We got New Orleans taking on Cleveland. Uh, both, we look, Cleveland's coming off a back-to-back situation where they just yeah. beat up on the Pistons, and they got the win there. And then, uh, you know, the Zion train is on the road now. Uh, look, right now we got New Orleans. Look at this. Minus eight. I, have, have we had, seen a spread where New Orleans is favored by more than eight on the road all year? I don't think so. You know, I mean, like I said, this is just kind of the Zion effect, you know, now that the books are kind of just overvaluing the Pelicans. Mm-hmm. I mean, so definitely uh, it, it seems a lot. But again, we are talking about the Cavs. So do we see here the Cavs just kind of falling apart as they usually do? I mean, the total is 233. So obviously the books are telling us uh, they're expecting some points right. with the Cavs, no defense. So uh, I don't know. You know, I'm a little leery of laying that many points after I see what Zion effect does on the road but uh i don't know i mean for right now i'm gonna i'm gonna stick with maybe getting cleveland at a higher uh maybe higher points tomorrow mm-hmm. i mean so today later excuse me uh maybe they get eight eight and a half and i'll take that you know, eight, you know i don't know i don't know but I, I just can't lay seven to eight points with new orleans on the road not just yet let mm-hmm. me let them prove themselves with zion and uh ingram and all the gang there so i mean that's yeah. where i'm at you know you so, know, Pelicans have been a cover machine lately. Pelicans are nine, two, and one against the spread in the last seven, no, the last twelve games uh, uh, against the spread. I, I think it's pretty pretty solid there for Pelicans. Yeah. Uh, Pelicans are four and zero against the spread in the last four games versus a team with uh, a, a winning record below four hundred. So they basically are are doing yeah. decent versus the the crappy teams. But yeah. man, it's like eight points is just a lot. It opened up at minus six. It got bet up to minus eight, and I don't think there's any value there. I think all the value is wow. going to bet out of the game. Um, for yeah. me, it's I'm probably going to stay off completely. Um, I know you're saying that it looks like they expect a lot of points to be scored. Yeah, yeah, two thirty three is the total what I'm seeing. So I mean, you know, uh, and, but, uh, and the trends, uh, all the trends are over, 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 yeah. over. However, the only trend that bucks that is the head to head trend. Uh, the yeah. under is eight and three in their last eleven meetings in Cleveland. This is a this is a tough one for me because yeah. you just don't know how bad Zion's going to show up. You don't know how the Cleveland Cavaliers are going to play. You uh you know they came off a back to back. I mean, as far as the injury report goes, the only injury I see for the Pelicans is Darius Miller, and he's been injured forever. Uh, but, yeah. you know that that came out in August. Now, you know for hmm. Cleveland, there's really nothing going on. Uh, Zizek looks like he's going to be out. Um. But, you know, he's been out for over a week anyway. So, guys, uh, if I had to choose a game, I don't do not like this, but I'm going to probably <laughs> choose the Pelicans just because I think they are the better team. But I'm not a big fan of it. So uh, that's where I'm at. Yeah, no, I, I can't disagree with you. Like I said, you know, I'm going to wait also to see tomorrow what the line moves to or let me later. See they keep so early, keep saying tomorrow. But I mean, you're right. I mean, just to kind of, you know, end it here. I'm going to look maybe an under also, like you said, because I do like that trend of them going under head to head, even though, again, New Orleans got, got over mm-hmm. a lot more. So, yeah, give me I'll, I'll, I'll lay a minute on the under and I'm going to wait to see if I can get a better number with Cleveland. If not, I kind of agree with you on New Orleans. So let's uh, let's see what. Yeah, guys, what if you guys want to talk about it, come join our private group. Uh, you can gain access to that access to that at SGDwins.com. It's where you can we talk about sports all day long in there. So it's a great community of like minded individuals. All we care about is beating the book. So let's get it. Let's get it, guys. If you want to see more content like this, guys, give us a thumbs up. Give us some comments. And let's get this next game, Jerry. We got the Boston Celtics visiting Miami. All right. Let's do it. Let's see you next week. Let's get it.